today is going to be a Fashion Friday video. I just went to the shops earlier today to do a little bit of shopping and I bought something very exciting. I got my first ever pair of loafers. These are them. I got the patent look with the gold bit detail. They're a little bit chunky. They're very, very cute and I thought we could style them up in a few fun ways. I've put together or I've envisioned five different outfits for the loafers and I thought we could put them together and give you a little bit of inspo on how to style up your loafers if you have a pair or if you're looking at getting a pair, a few of the different ways that you can wear them. So let's get straight into it. This isn't one of the outfits, obviously. <laughs> um, it's super cute, super cash, but it is not a loafer outfit. So my first outfit idea is very Parisian inspired. If you saw my last weekly vlog, you saw that I got a little parcel from Princess Polly and I picked up two things. I picked up this little black skirt and also this really cute striped beige and black collared sweater. Now, I think these two would look really cute with some stockings. And I also got these socks that have a really cool detail on them. I'll show you properly when I have unboxed or taken them out of the packaging. But I think all of that together with a bag and some accessories would be really cute. Okay, so I love this outfit. I think it's really cute. I do not like these uh, stockings at all. They're really, really cheap. I don't actually own any. I thought it would be cute. And like it would be if these were better quality, but they've already got a ladder in them and I've been wearing them for like five seconds. They're brand new. Um, but I like the way this turned out. I think this is a really cute classic way to wear it. Um, I'm a big fan. I love this bag. I think it goes with it really well. Um, I could see myself like under the Eiffel Tower. I think the bow is like so stinking cute and the loafers are obviously adorable so that would be outfit number one i also have this i have this really cute hair bow as well it's i have not worn it before obviously but it's this little satiny bow and i thought with that outfit it would be such a vibe be really really cute the second outfit's going to be following the very same bottoms so i would stick with the stockings the skirt and the shoes but i would switch up the tops with a bit of a different look so i have this black turtleneck, um, which I think this is a bit more of a winter inspired one, but I have this black turtleneck and then this white bag. Um, and then I think I would take out the bow and maybe do like a sweater over the shoulders, maybe like a cream one or even the striped one again could be really cute. And then I think this little white bag is going to break up all of that black on black on black. Um, and sort of tie in with the socks a little bit more. Okay. Outfit number two. I like this one. I think it looks really chic. Uh, I like the tiny little bag. This one does come with like a strap inside of it, but I like the handheld look instead. I think the white matches in with the socks nicely and it all sort of brings it together. I love it. And I left the hair bow in for this outfit as well because I think it matches really nicely uh, and looks really cute so for this third look i think a little bit of a layering moment so i have my white button down that i wear all the time i need to uh, do some stain removing on the collar because i got fake tan on it oops but i think a white button down with this blue sweater layered over the top with the collar peeking out and then some classic dark wash blue jeans um this one's gonna be a super preppy look but i think with the loafers and then I'm going to do no socks, no stockings, no anything. It's just going to be like bare ankle with the loafers. And I think it's going to look really, really nice. Okay, outfit number three. I like the way this turned out. It's a bit more of like a casual preppy look. Um, I actually, with just the white shirt, it looked kind of cute as well. But I love the way it turns out with the sweater. I think the sweater just needs to be like tucked under a little bit. So that it doesn't look too frumpy. And then I like the bare ankle with the loafers. I did have to cuff these jeans because they were a little bit too long, but I think this is a overall very cute look. And I think for this one, the black shoulder bag, again, is cute. It adds a little bit something and it matches with the shoes really nicely. Now, when I was putting together all these outfits, I got a lot of inspiration from Pinterest. Um, I, I saw like quite a few ideas and this was one that I really, really loved. I don't have the exact pieces, but basically it's almost wearing the blazer like a dress. You wear something really tiny underneath, so you're obviously wearing something, but it's mostly to do with the blazer. So I have this little black t-shirt dress. It's super old from Cotton On, but it's just sort of like an underneath layer to wear and it's a bodycon fit. 
so that I have this gorgeous blazer to put over the top. This one's super structured. It's from Forever New. It has gold, oops, it has gold details on the front and also on the cuffs here. And it's a really solid, heavy blazer. So I think this, and then belted together with this black belt, it's got this gold buckle on it, which I think is going to look really nice. And basically, I'm going to cinch the belt over the top of the blazer, and I think it's going to look really nice. And then I have this little white bag with a little scarf on it, and I think this is going to really complement the outfit. It's going to be a bit classy, a little bit different, and I think it's going to look really beautiful. Okay, outfit number four. I put the stockings back on for this one because I thought they suited it, and I think this needs to be buttoned up. I don't know if the belt's gonna go with it because it actually has this button in the middle, but let's just try it and see how it looks. I think that looks very cheap. I do feel like the dress needs to be like slightly shorter. Like it needs to be pretty much the same length as the jacket. Um, I feel like the jacket could be even more oversized. This one's actually quite fitted, more fitted than I remember. Um, but I like this outfit. I think this is very, very classy. Um, I love the loafers with it. I think that it really adds that nice touch of classiness. You don't look too underdressed. And I like the belt. I think it really cinches in the waist. Even though there's a button, I think it really works. And then the bag, I have this white bag. And I think this is really cute. Now, the last outfit I have in mind is going to be a bit more of a workwear inspired look. Um, I have this black high neck t-shirt. Um, it's a full length t-shirt, it's going to be tucked into the pants, but I think this with my taut pants, these are like a dress pant from Princess Polly, these are the archer pants and I love them. Um, I think this is a really nice office look and then again the loafers with a bare ankle is going to look really nice with this. Um, we'll see how it goes because these pants are a bit long for me so it might look a bit funny, I need to go get these tailored. Um, but we'll test it out when I try it all on together and see how it looks. And then sticking with the workwear theme, we're going to go for a bigger bag on this one. So this is one of my normal everyday work bags. It's from Peter and Jane. It is falling apart a little bit. I am due to get a new one. But I do really like the shape of this bag and the way that it sits in the crook of the arm. I think it's very corporate, um, corporate chic. Um, but yeah, let's put on a few of these outfits and see how they all look together. Okay. Final outfit. I decided to add this sweater back on over the shoulders. I think it looks very classy and sophisticated. Uh, it looks a little... I can't decide if it looks cute or weird because the t-shirt underneath is obviously a short sleeve. Um, but I think it's cute. I like the bag. It definitely adds uh, a bit of that corporate feel. Now, the pants, as I suspected, are a little long, so it looks a little bit clunky with the loafers. Um, but once I get them hemmed, I think this will be a really cute look. It just sort of needs to be ankle length, and at the moment, they almost touch the ground. But I'm very happy with this final outfit. I would definitely wear this to work when it gets a little bit cooler. Um, yeah, and I changed my hair to a low bun. I just feel like it fits, oops, that it fits this outfit a little bit better. Alrighty guys, that is it for today's video. I really love how all the outfits turned out to be honest. Um, the only one that I, the only thing that was annoying was those stockings were just really unflattering on me to be honest. I think I just need to get like better quality ones because they were really crappy. <laughs> um, but yeah, the final outfit turned out well. I just need to hem the pants a little bit because I knew they were too long for me anyway. Um, yeah, that is all for today's video. I do hope you enjoyed it. If you're enjoying these fashion videos from me, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you want to see because it helps me realize that you do enjoy these kinds of videos. Um, but yeah, that's all for today. I hope you have a wonderful day or night wherever you are and I will see you in a future video. Bye!